Memories of Great Granddaddy Soul Phenomenon, the Soul Soldier, watching by a different kind of beat. I call it like I see it. Now dig this. Drop it. It's a dry spin. Young, Young girls crowded with the jails, making home in a cell. Living in the day is almost like living in hell. But the D ain't the only city, fighting hard times everywhere. You see corruption and crime Women are not protected Elders are not respected Babies seem to be neglected Old people are rejected Always inspected Justice is suspected Truth is not reflected Some say to have a good life You got to choose right You pass it to win the fight You got to see the light When you're working on the dark Don't be afraid No how to be hate There are all types of soldiers in all types of wars They don't even know what they're really fighting for Are they fighting for the wealthy so they can gain more? Oh, imaginary borders I fight for myself I take my own orders I got to roll out the molar Did them holler for help again Greetings. This is Professor Soul School Phenomenon. And uh, today's subject is the King Alfred plan and how to win this upcoming battle that everyone is focusing in on and I'm going to give you or drop some seeds on how to avoid being slaughtered and how to win the battle if time permits if not we will do a part two first of all you gotta quit putting yourselves into tribes and saying that one truth is wiser or better than another truth so you got the different various Hebrew, Israelite nations. And they got their philosophy. And it comes from the Bible. And you got the Kemet nation, or the Kemet, Kemetic society. They got their philosophy. Then you got the nation of Islam. And it's various splinter groups that's off into in the nation of Islam. And um, right there, just that alone means defeat. Because why are you trying to? You know, rationalize on who got the, the absolute truth. There's a division there. Yes, there's a division. No unity. So you can't organize your troops. You 
need to be doing strategy. Now some say we should flee. It says that in the scriptures that it might be a time when we might have to flee. But in the Quran, it says fight. Now, those two philosophies or strategies are for different times in different circumstances. I, for one, believe that there's a mothership because when I was about 12, 13, I was cutting the grass over on Wildermere in Detroit on the west side and I seen a object in the sky doing maneuvers that no other object or plane at that time could do. So I knew it was a mothership connection there. And I believe that there is a mothership. But I also believe that here in Detroit, we're supposed to stand our ground, have some fortitude about ourselves, be in unity with ourselves. And so we got to show an example of unity before I believe the mothership will even interfere. If there's no unity, then, you know, what's the sense of the mothership interfering until we get right with ourselves? So, I suggest that all the gangs, street gangs, street organizations, and all the community organizations, all the black clubs, start organizing themselves. First you gotta clean yourself up. Get the evil out yourself before you can deal with anything else. You gotta love yourself before you can love anything, anyone else. So we gotta start unifying ourselves, come together, and just that unity alone is more than half the battle won. So, the second thing I, I won't, you know, belabor on, but just want to suggest this, and you think about it. Everybody say you got to grow your own food, but you really need your own currency to trade amongst yourself and others. And you can't use this currency. You got to come up with a monetary system of your own. You could give value to anything you want it to be. Third thing, we must start watching and teaching our children the truth. Maybe that should be number one. Giving them, it should be a code of conduct code of conduct in each neighborhood or each community to have a code of conduct. And I'm going to go into these points later. Second, third, fourth thing we got to uh, discuss is we got to quit doing these debates. Now is not the time. Now what we got to do is come together Identify those agents, those boule among us, cast them out. So we're going to have to have some uh, investigators. We're going to have to have some scientists. This is the fifth thing. We got to be scientists now. 
So those that are already scientists, you know, we got to produce more scientists. And we could beat the man without having to fire a shot. We don't have to fire a shot. You know, don't be scared. Don't be fearful. You understand what I'm saying? Because that way, those who say they believe in God, if you're scared, you don't believe in God. You can't pledge allegiance to a flag before you pledge allegiance to God. You got to recognize truth when you see it. And some of those leaders that we got are hypocrites and agents for the enemy. You see what I'm saying? So, we're going to have to do some house cleaning. And I'm going to come back later on in the program with, uh, or later on in the next series or next uh, video with some more suggestions, suggestions and uh, dropping more seeds. But right now you just take that in. You can beat the King Alpha plan. How? You got to have a plan of your own. That's superior than the King Alpha plan. You got to do a checkmate on it. Don't be so scared. All these uh, they're trying to scare you into, uh, scare you out your mind, really. So you won't think. And, you know, got some of you wanting to run, flee the country. But we settle on the best part of the land. In the United States, the best part is where we got all this the Great Lakes. We got all this fresh water. That's the best part, Detroit. We got all the fresh water. You see what they're doing up in Flint. It's no accident. <clears throat> they're trying to clear, clear us out of here. Yep. Trying to clear us out, and uh, but we got a black. <clears throat> excuse me, we got an all black in Detroit, all black police force, and they got to figure out a way to infiltrate the all black police force, get agents in there, pay them off, sabotage the police chief and uh, start moving uh, the enemy in. So we're going to close this uh, segment down for right now. Peace. Greetings, my great granddad, soul phenomenon, the soul soldier, watching by a different kind of people. Young guns crowded the jails, making home in a cell. Living in the D is almost like living in hell. But the D ain't the only city fighting hard times everywhere you look. You see corruption and crime. Women are not protected, elders are not respected. Babies seem to be neglected. Poor people are rejected. You always inspected. Justice is suspected. Truth is not reflected. Some say to have a good life, you got to choose right And I say to win the fight, you got to see the light When you're walking in the dark, don't be afraid, know how to behave There are all types of soldiers in all types of wars Many of them don't even know what they're really fighting for Are they fighting for the wealthy so they can gain more? Oh, imaginary orders, I fight for myself I take my own orders, 